Hello, my name is Dr. Alan Sabe, and uh, in behalf of uh, myself and our co-authors, uh, glad to introduce our upcoming paper in Family Process titled A Family Reunion of Clinical Cousins, Attachment and Emotion in Four Family-Oriented Therapy Models. This paper is an extension and a continuation of the Summit for Attachment and Emotion Family Therapy that was held in 2021. Uh, through the Family Institute at Northwestern University. The intention of the summit and the, this paper is to foster openness, collaboration, and affirmation between four family-oriented therapy models uh, with shared theoretical roots in attachment theory and emotion science. The models uh, in the summit and in this paper are attachment-based family therapy with Dr. Guy Diamond, motion-focused family therapy with Dr. Adela France, Dyadic, dyadic Developmental Psychotherapy with Dr. Dan Hughes, and Emotionally Focused Family Therapy with Dr. James Furrow. Overall, uh, in this paper, we're continuing to demonstrate um, and describe how a broad and accurate view of attachment and emotion, attachment theory and emotion science can be effectively utilized to uh, intervene in a variety of presenting problems at the level of uh, family. We recognize and describe the extensive history of attachment and uh, of how attachment and emotion has been applied uh, to clinical methodology. And the paper works to synthesize uh, and integrate across uh, the, the theory and the different models presented here to hopefully grow the effectiveness and the efficiency of our field. Again, we are wanting to argue how an understanding of attachment and emotion science provides a solid and valuable foundation for our field of family therapy, as it um, acknowledges and incorporates the interpersonal dynamics around systems theory, the intrapsychic experience of, of at the individual level, uh, and then also leaves room for uh, acknowledgement of larger systems and how they influence and shape individual and family functioning. Uh, specifically, we clearly frame attachment and emotional experiences in sociocultural contexts in order to avoid uh, and prevent any sense of parental uh, blame. In the paper, um, as we did in the summit, we present brief summaries of each of the models. Uh, we delineate how attachment and emotion um, science leads to the development of clinical methods by describing the similarities across the models, as well as how the differences complement each other. We uh, also include highlight quotes from the presenters throughout the paper. We hope that the paper will be read and utilized by clinicians to sharpen their therapeutic focus and work specifically those who are utilizing um, attachment and emotion uh, approaches in their, in their clinical work by researchers to guide um, hypotheses and relevant research methods, and then by educators, by students, to deepen their understanding of the theory and science behind these models, as well as other effective therapeutic approaches in our field of family therapy. So we hope you enjoy the article and would love to hear what you think.